today we are going to create this glow sketch effect in photoshop hey guys dev here again from adobe vibe youtube channel in this video i will show you how to make a glow sketch effect in photoshop without knowing a hand paper drawing before start this video be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell for getting update whenever i upload a new video and you can follow me on instagram where i post my new design artwork all right as always select your image make a copy of it by control j go to adjustment gradient map use basic black and white Now select both copy layer and black and white. Right click, merge layers as I make it in one layer. Rename it as black and white and again make a copy of black and white image by control J and change blend mode to color dodge. Then hit control I invert from your keyboard. Go to top menu, filter, blur, Gaussian blur. Select your blur radius according to your need. Here I am using 42% for this image. Create a new layer just below the first black and white image. Fill with white color as a background. You can merge both above layers and make it as one layer. Now this is an optional step. I am bringing below color image to top and using object selection tool and selecting this flower as I want this flower to remain as a color. Hit Ctrl J. Now delete the color image as no needed and change blend mode of the flower layer to multiply. Adding vibrance. Now go to drawing image layer, add mask on it, take a brush, make foreground color black and gently brush on the outside area. As removing the background and keeping only this pretty girl image. Using some levels to make a little bit dark on this sketch. Now select all layers and put it in a group folder by Ctrl J. Take a snapshot by Ctrl plus Alt plus Shift plus E from your keyboard. I need to extend this background. So by Crop tool I am extending my background. Mm -hmm. 
This is an optional step as this image have some harsh on edges. So adding a mask on it and using brush to remove it. Alright, now add new layer above the sketch and fill with black color. Reduce opacity around 70 to 75%. Rename it as a dark layer. Again add a new blank layer and take brush, hardness 0. Select any color you like. And brush some part of this image like this. It look like this but don't worry we will fix it later. To remember all layers always better to rename it. Rename it as a add color. Then change it blend mode to color dodge. Now it's very hard color look. So go to filter, blur, Gaussian blur. Again select radius according to your need. Here I am using 12% for this image. Reduce opacity around 70 to 75%. Uh, we are almost done. Again this is my additional touch to make this artwork a little bit more pop. And that's it, this is my final output. As always I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please don't forget to click the like button, comment on this video and subscribe to my channel. You can support me on my Instagram account link in video description. And also you can check out the other amazing video just waiting for you in this channel playlist. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.